What up, my Nigerians? What up, Ghanaians? What up, Africans? My people, how y'all doing? It's your boy, Ajim Max, on this one again. Guess what is happening? Many of you have been seeing it, but let me talk about it. Let us share the details. Let me tell you guys how far and what is so special and what is exciting about this very issue. Ghanaian YouTuber, Woodmeyer. I always tell you guys, I like that boy. I like with my I see him as a mentor. I see him as a big bro because this guy, his impact is real when it comes to YouTube in Africa. You understand? But Woodmeyer is a Ghanaian, and you know when it comes to Ghana and Nigeria, there is always something going on. But guess what? Woodmeyer is in Nigeria right now as an talk. A lot of Ghanaians need to watch this video. A lot of you Ghanaians need to watch this video that I'm doing right now. Would Maya, your brother from Ghana, is actually in Nigeria right now as we are talking. He's flexing, he's enjoying life, and no Nigerian is disturbing Would Maya. No Nigerian is trying to stress him. Nobody is trying to, oh, why did you come to Nigeria? Do you want to come and show this? Nobody is giving Would Maya any headache. Woodmire is in Nigeria, he's flexing, he's enjoying, he's eating Nigerian food. Even though I love the way he's doing it because he's eating Nigerian food, celebrating that Nigeria has the best food. Woodmire is in Nigeria, eating Nigerian food, celebrating that Nigeria has the best food. It doesn't matter if he's joking. It doesn't matter if he's saying that just because he wants to please the Nigerian audience. It doesn't matter if he's saying that just because he wants Nigerian love. He wants Nigeria to show him love. He wants Nigeria to respect him. He, he wants Nigeria to treat him. It doesn't matter. As long as he's posting it on social media, saying that Nigeria has the best food. Some Ghanaians have seen it and they will believe him. Some Ugandans, some Kenyans, some Cameroonians, everybody that is following him, we see it as a good reason maybe to go to Nigeria, maybe to try Nigeria food, or see Nigeria as an amazing place. I love the fact that Woodmire is still going back to Nigeria despite his success. Because I've said it before, that Nigeria contributed more than 90% to Woodmire's success. By the time Woodmire left China, most of the videos that put Woodmire on the map, they are videos about Nigeria, and most of his followers and most of the people that have uplifted him to the level that he got to before Ghanaians started supporting, before other people in the world, Africans started supporting, they are Nigerians who get with Maya the platform, get him everything. And I really love the fact that he is going back to appreciate Nigeria, to show love to Nigeria. I saw with Maya's video in Lagos. With Maya driving in Lagos, showing the beautiful part of Nigeria, showing the beautiful roads, the beautiful city, the amazing views in Nigeria. And that just got me thinking, this is how it should be done. This is exactly how it should be done. No matter how the Ghana versus Nigeria issue goes to what level, whenever a Ghana is in Nigeria, they are received with love. And I think that the people that have to learn the biggest lesson is Ghanaians. Is Ghana because the Nigerian YouTubers that are in Ghana, <laughs> I will get to that topic another day. Don't bother, I cannot even talk about that one now. I cannot. I didn't see Woodmire in a single video trying to say that Nigeria is better than Ghana in this place, Nigeria is better than Ghana in this place, Nigeria has done this, Ghana hasn't done this, Nigeria has did that, Ghana has. I didn't see any video, any post from Woodmire in that light. But we all know what Nigerian YouTubers in Ghana are doing. We all know. You understand? So, this, when I saw, I follow up. I said, no, I will follow up what Woodmire is doing. He's going to Innocent Vehicles again. again. I'm sure that will be like the fourth or fifth video that Innocent Vehicle is giving Woodmire the opportunity to shoot. Marketing Innocent Vehicles and at the same time, creating his content to make big money. Receiving all the support and receiving all the love. So, why can't Ghanaians learn from their brother Woodmire? Ghanaians, why can't you people learn from your brother Woodmire who is in Nigeria, enjoying and flexing? Why can't you people see the... What, it's, a, it's a perfect example what Woodmire is showing Ghanaians. Even though sometimes I know say yes. Let's forget about the football issue that happened last time. I saw his post on Facebook. He... 
I made a video about Woodmeyer and he took the comments from my video and posted on Facebook. That's when I know that yes, even as at the top, Woodmeyer they follow, Woodmeyer they see, and people they see what they do. Because the comments that you guys left on the video I made about him regarding what happened after the loss that Nigeria lost in the AFCON final, Woodmeyer posted it. You guys didn't see it? He posted it. But he then said he thought it was just a football banter. So according to Woodmeyer, he loves Nigeria. Of course, he has no choice than to love Nigeria because they have actually given him so much more. So much. So he has the right to love Nigeria and celebrate Nigeria. So I really did appreciate the fact that he, he his, the video got to him, he saw it, and he reacted to the video, and he made that post online. It gave me joy, and I said, no, I deserve to love this man. I'm supposed to love Woodmire. Seeing him in Nigeria again gives me joy. Seeing Woodmire in Nigeria again really gives me joy. But I think that the bigger lesson goes to Ghanaians and Nigerian YouTubers who are in Ghana. We will still address that topic. We will definitely address that topic. Because once Woodmire enters Nigeria, he's celebrating Nigerian food, celebrating the way Nigerians are doing things, the pepper in the food, that's why he's celebrating. The roads, the amazing views, innocent vehicles, many beautiful things that Nigerians are doing. That's what Udumaya is doing. If those, our Ye Ye YouTubers, where they Ghana, if they were just showing beautiful things about Ghana without trying to make Nigeria look the way they are trying to make it, we will not have a problem. They choose to celebrate. It's just like me. I'm celebrating Nigeria, but I don't try to make Cameroon look anyhow. I celebrate Nigeria. My country's Cameroon, I don't talk about them, I don't have positive or negative, no, I'm not interested. I celebrate the good things about Nigeria and Africans, and we win together. So I think that Ghanaians should learn from Woodmire, and most importantly, those Nigerian YouTubers. Woodmire, you're right, Nigeria has the best food. Enjoy it, I'm coming soon. See you guys, God bless you all. Cheers!